The Highlands is so wonderful for wildlife, uh, but it's great that we're so secluded here. We're tucked yeah. into a little fold in the hills and uh, there is no disturbance really. There's no agriculture, there's no commercial forestry around us. And so uh, uh, I think the wildlife seem to recognize that and we're just very, very fortunate. Miranda, it's lovely to have you here. Thank, Thank you. you very much for coming to see us. Uh, I hope you've had fun. Oh, just had the best time. When I announced to my, my children that we're going to Agas, they, their eyes just light up and they're so excited because they've had so many fantastic wildlife experiences here. They know that they're going to be really, really up close to pine martins and badgers and this trip has not failed to produce all the wildlife that we expect. You did a hide visit last night. We did. And Tell us about oh, it. Oh gosh, it's, it's amazing. We had three pine martins. Oh wow. And then uh, they were seen off by a badger and then another badger. So in the space of about 45 minutes, with three pine martins and two badgers. My son said he was tingling with excitement. And you do feel like you can just reach out and touch them. And you're in the hide, but the windows are open. So there's nothing between you and the animal. So you can hear them sort of snuffling in the undergrowth. You can hear them eating. You can see all the detail. It's it's so magical and those close-up experiences are so important for children, especially nowadays where we only really see wildlife on television. And coming up here um, and having those experiences is just so special and they have such a connection with the wildlife coming here. Well, we're so lucky here because this little loch here it seems to be a sort of hub for wildlife. You know, we have ospreys and otters uh, and we've got a beaver project. Yeah. Have you seen any yes. signs of the beavers? <laughs> well, we came out uh, the night before last, and then we saw your enormous beaver. Yes, a great Which was chat. just fantastic. And you can watch him swimming around and ducking down and then coming back up again. Um, and, and again, for the kids to see a beaver in the wild is just so magical. You've got it all here. You've got red squirrels, yes. you've got crested tits, you've got otters, beavers. Yeah. We've seen bats flying. Um, Rodeo, red just deer, absolutely and brilliant. wildcats. And of course your wildcats, That's which right. is something. I mean, you've had great success with the wildcats, haven't you? Yeah, we have. I've lived here for 40 years and I've only seen wildcats in the wild about half a dozen times. Occasionally you see one in the headlights of your car but uh, I think now they're so critically endangered that the only future for them is captive breeding and release back into the wild. And that's what we're doing here. And it's a really important conservation project.